the kids out there. You only have a few more weeks of summer left because the new school year is right around the corner. Wow, wow. Well, and you can help them get ready for a great year right now. It's a partnership between WDSU TV and these community businesses and organizations. And reporter Kelsey Davis joins us live this morning at the Salvation Army to tell us more about the school supply drive. Good morning, Kelsey. Good morning, Randy. That's right. Today's day one of the Class Act School Supply Drive, sponsored by us and partnered with the Salvation Army. With us right now, Jessica Shaw, Community Relations Director here at the Salvation Army. Uh, talk again about why this is such an important thing to have for people across the greater New Orleans area. Absolutely. We've got school kicking off in a couple of weeks, and we want to make sure these kids start off on the right foot. They have everything they need. And for a lot of families out there, it's tough just putting food on the table and getting, you know, everything they need. So we want to make sure those kids don't fall through the cracks. And they have their pencils, pens, papers, whatever they need to be successful this school year. Now, for people who either want to help or want to get help, what, what can you tell us? What, where do they need to go and when? Okay. If you want to help, we are collecting school supplies through the 17th. You can drop them off here or at any of our other locations, and I believe you guys have a list on your website. Right. So go there. And then if you need help, we start distribution tomorrow. So you can start tomorrow, and it goes until the 17th as well. Um, come Monday through Friday, 8 to 2, and you, you're going to need two things. You're going to need one, a photo ID of the parent, and then a birth certificate or a food stamp award letter for each child that you need school supplies for. All right. Well, make Sure, that's a lot of information. So make sure we get that on our website for you too. Uh, the times that you can drop off supplies, pick up supplies, and what you need if you are coming to pick up supplies. Again, photo ID, food stamp card, or letter for each child, and a parent uh, birth certificate rather for each of those kids. Again, a lot of information that we'll get to our website for you, including all the drop off locations. Again, this is just day one of the Class X school supply drive, but it runs through the 17th of August. For now, reporting on your side, Kelsey Davis, WDSU News. Thank you, Kelsey. A lot of information. So, again, here's how you can make a difference. Check out WDSU.com for a list of what is needed and bring those needed supplies to the kids for uh, less uh, store, for the four less store at Esplanade Mall or any Iberia Bank location. And we got those posted on our website. Uh, to make it easy, just click on the Class Act Story. The Class Act School Supply Drive is brought to you by those organizations and by the Glago Law Firm and, of course, by us, WDSU, always on your side. We now